Hello guys, what's going on? It's Lemon King back here for another Minecraft adventure map, or I should say parkour map. And in the theme of Christmas, we are doing the 24 parkour maps for Christmas. Uh, it's a map that's been played last year by uh, Aurelian. And we're going to give it a challenge for herself, but we're not going to be doing this the same, obviously, when this video goes up. It's not starting with number one and doing one episode a day. What it's actually going to be doing is I'm going to upload five at a time for that for five episodes. So let's see, let's let's see if I can write this down. Here. So Xmas parkour. I don't like saying Xmas. So there's going to be five parts, and it's raining. So yeah, we're going to have five parts. Um, jump maps one through Sorry. we're gonna set this to keep so we're gonna keep the inventory true so we can keep our stuff after we die so let's get started up here with level one I'm set. Off into level one. Alright, it's like we're in a library. Cool. Oh I man, I already failed, you know. That's that's not good. You know when you fail right off the bat, it's not gonna be a good day. Why did I do part of that? Speed though, look at that speed though. All right, so it's like it's very intricate down there, but I don't want to go down there to find out what's going on. Single black jump, single black jump. So I was thinking, I thought I could do it like one a day, like the 25 or 24 parkour maps for Christmas, but I just don't have the time to upload one of these a day. So now it's gonna be I guess we'll do five at a time and then yeah so this I think the first video for this should be up the 17th of December I know I'm dating my content here but this is 2014 and this is the seven this will be up the 17th of the first episode mouse is stuck and in the last episode we have the 21st and that's it because then I have to go on a Christmas vacation. I have to do some vacation stuff. My cousins are coming home and I have to do all kinds of crazy stuff. So, you'll see a... Dang it. You'll see a vlog about that. Later. But, just, just so you guys know that... That's why it's before Christmas. So... It's the same principle, it's getting close to Christmas. Being trolled. Christmas is coming and the goose is getting fat. Time to prepare for Christmas and hopefully you guys enjoy the Christmas music. That's going to be backing me up in these videos. Instead of just me speaking all the time. Damn it. The frustration. So I don't, I don't care how long this video is going to be. Getting done parkour maps one through five in this episode. So this episode could be five minutes, or it could be 45 minutes. But we're getting done one through five today. I guess it'd be one, two, three, four. Yeah, one through five. Yeah, let's jump down on why it's causing problems. There we go. Okay, making our way over here. Single block jumps suck. 
He's going with like a head of fury and then go flying over him. No! Jesus. Man. <laughs> We can do this. We can do this. It's not that difficult. I torture myself with parkour for your guys' enjoyment. Not for my enjoyment. Alright. One jump by jump. It's a very nice map, though. Well done. In the architectural standpoint of it. You think about how intricate these maps are, but realistically, they're not that hard to build with the help of world edit but it does take a while to like plot these out and how you want to get this set up but if you don't use world edit it's like wow it's close. these maps are really well done and I know that my little cousin Dominic has a, a book when I was down at, for Thanksgiving at their house Now Thanksgiving, I was reading out of the book, and it was like a construction book, and it was telling you all the like tips and tricks to building kind of structures like these, like castles and intricate walls, and there was some unique features that I never really heard of that can work to make your workload a lot easier. So that was a that was a good read. I only have the Minecraft like main, the first book of the Minecraft book series. I don't remember what it's called. It's somewhere in this room in my office. I have it in here somewhere. But it's just like going over like a general overview like the animals, what we humans do. And there's like a article by Cabin Sparkles. Like their first night in Minecraft. And no more normally everybody's first night in Minecraft does not end very well. Oh I why did I do that? Yeah, normally everyone's first might, night in Minecraft it usually ends to a creeper explosion. So. If we can just please get through this first stage, I mean, you know, not the best at parkour, but this is horrendous. Horrendous parkour. And I do realize that this would be a whole lot better if I were doing it with someone. But maybe you guys can help me out here. I... I do not have the ability to host games on my computer. I don't know why, because I set up everything right and then people just can't access the server. And I have the Wi-Fi open and everything, but people just can't access it. So I don't know why, but I can't get that to work. I need to go with that, but I've tried everything, so I highly doubt that's going to work. And I don't have any other friends that host servers either. And I really don't want to have to go buy one just to play this game, so if you can lead me in the right direction, that'd be extremely helpful. Making better content for you guys. So, that's just helping you out more. And I know there's a lot of people who don't watch my stuff fully, which I understand. But, it doesn't really do anything if you don't watch the full video, how do you know you like it? That's the stuff that I think about every time when I'm watching a video by someone, I'm like, I really, I don't know if I want to watch the full thing. Then I do, and then I get through it all, and I'm like, oh, I actually learned something. It's actually really cool. Glad I did. So, that's the whole point of things. There's, I see a lot of people who, I can check my view ratings and see. see how long my view duration is and sometimes it's like really short in videos like only two minutes I'm like what the heck is wrong here it's just oh and the, the thing another thing is that adds on to that for all you small youtubers out there most of the population of viewers only gets directed towards the big guys so there's people who only watch that is not only watch these people so in reality you're losing all of the because they refuse to watch other people and I watch a whole load of people I know it's like being a small YouTuber, so I go out and watch other small YouTubers. Why not? 
to gather content is watch their content, help them out, in turn help myself out. So that's the whole thing is a lot of people lean on the big YouTubers and what happens when they're done, what happens when they retire from YouTube and stop YouTube. That's when the viewers are going to start dispersing. And that's when you'll gain more viewers. But my content is... A lot of people say... I hear mixed reviews about my content, honestly. There's people who say I'm really funny. And I've talked to a bunch of people on different social medias. I've been recognized out in public. There's people who say my content is really good. There's people who say it sucks. And I'm like... Well, if you're going to compare my content to Skyrim Mecca or Minecraft, all those big name YouTubers, yeah, there's going to be a distinct difference. And that's how a lot of people see it. They're like, oh, well, I'm just going to base everybody off how successful this guy is. And you don't look at other unique features that I do. If I don't do the exact same things as Captain Sparkles, then they're going to say, oh, your content's not good. It's not like this. how people are. So I do my content my own way. I do this as a hobby. And there's people, I understand there's a lot of people out there who try to do YouTube just right off the bat as for a living. And I can tell you right now it's not going to happen. You just try to say, well I just want to do YouTube for a living. So I'm just going to go out there and expecting to make tons of money. And that's not the, it's not going to happen because the thing about Dude Boulder Fist. He said in his videos, so I watch his videos a lot, about how he started YouTube as a hobby, just to make people laugh, something else to do, get him off his butt. <laughs> and he never dreamed that someday this would be his job. And look what happened. So the key is you can dream, but you can't just push yourself. What the heck is this? You know what? Russ will be here for 10 days. Sorry. I'm going to be here for 10 days. So, that's what I'm getting at. Just based off content. It's like, if you're going to base my content off other guys, yeah, it's not going to be as good. But, there's people who don't see that. They just enjoy my head. Still, this is more Christmas themed here. out there to all you young YouTubers. If you try to go at this for a living, more than likely, it's not going to happen. So, just don't go out there planning on, oh, I'm going to be Scott as Minecraft and make a million dollars. It's like, no, just don't plan on that. Because when it doesn't happen, you're going to be bummed. And that's what a lot of YouTubers do. They do that, and then they don't, they don't stick with it. I may do a checkpoint system, yeah. Just make life a ton of easierness. Oh, I, was, I think this is the way to go. <sighs> so that's the lesson. Don't go as this for a hot. Go out, use YouTube as a hobby. Don't try to make a living out of it. Oh, God damn it. I was on this block. Because if you do, more than likely you're not going to succeed. Yeah, it's better. So, so, all those people out there who are yelling at my content, like your content sucks, you're not good. I'm like, what do you do from there? I'm just like, all right, whatever you say. Jump here. 
Yeah, so it's, the checkpoint system is very useful to learn. I don't know if I'm making any of these jumps. Oh god. I'm trying some different ways here. I think that seems like a logical place to go, right? Is that even possible? It's possible. On the side of these fence posts like that, it doesn't allow you to jump. There we go. Oh my god, how does that how does that even happen? How do you just with how do you what? How do you miss this jump? God damn it, what the fuck am I doing? What the fuck? Thank you. And number four. This video's gonna be long, but it's worth it. It's all worth it. Parkour, maybe it is, but I can see how you can take one episode a day.
Evet. Yeah, you have to have keep him around here or else you lose him. Everything. Man, this is tough. They're at like the last... It doesn't give me enough time to, that's, that's the thing. It doesn't give me enough time to see where the jump is. Like a lot of all these plays, just hard enough. That's hard enough. What is this? I don't know. I get to the end of this. <sighs> what? That's not even fair. I mean, I didn't even get to the end of that portion yet. We get five more attempts, and then we're moving past this. It's just ridiculous. I mean, it's not even really fair. So bad. Oh, red one. Yeah, we're done. So that's the end of the first episode, guys. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please remember to leave a like. It'd be greatly appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next episode very shortly.